Hello, my name is Simon Laird and I'm the Global Head of Insurance at RPC and welcome to our annual insurance review. Looking back at some of the events and developments of 2018 uh, and some of those anticipated trends that we think will be of interest to you for 2019. Climate change continued to dominate the headlines during 2018. If it was the hurricanes that were the apparent symptom of global warming during 2017, then it was certainly the California wildfires that generated the headlines and record losses during 2018. More generally, the frequency and economic cost of uh, extreme weather uh, patterns is continuing to impact on various sectors within the insurance market. 2018 continued to see a focus around uh, cybercrime and terrorism, which we expect to see continue into 2019 meaning that insurers can expect to see increased business interruption losses, uh, onward payments of damages to third parties and leaks of personal data. I can't do an insurance overview without mentioning blockchain. Uh, and blockchain generally managed to grab the attention of the regulators during 2018 and we expect that to continue into 2019. The other thing we've seen is the seemingly endless list of potential uses of blockchain. And 2018 was no different. And we mentioned in the annual insurance review, one of those particular potential uses, uh, which is as an impermeable registry for the provenance of fine artworks. The other changes that our sector experts have identified uh, as potentially having an impact on the insurance market across the globe uh, include the influence of fake news, uh, potentially resulting in group litigation, an increase in hashtag MeToo allegations, so that could potentially generate EPL type claims uh, and even possibly DNO claims. The use of drones and satellite imagery for the purposes of assessing insurance losses. The use of AI for healthcare diagnostics and company insolvencies uh, throughout the globe, but particularly uh, UK and China. And all of this at a time when the global harmony of trade uh, is under increasing threat from increased state protectionism, trade wars, sanctions, and of course, Brexit, meaning that some experts are now predicting a global downturn in 2019. We hope you enjoy reading the annual insurance review. And if you have any questions about any of the issues, trends, or events mentioned in the document, then please do not hesitate to contact our sector experts. Thank you for watching.